The Adventures of Napkin Man. <laughs> Lots of spots. Good morning, little froggies. When I play my awesome song, you jump, jump, jump. Very good. But when I stop, you stop. Jump, jump, jump. When I rock out, you jump, jump, jump. But when I stop, you stop. Jump, jump, jump. That's enough jumping for this morning, my little froggies. Why don't you hop over to the art table and do some drawings? Jump, jump, jump! Hey, Scott the Frog, you seem very jumpy today. I am jumpy and super excited. Super excited? Wow. It feels like I have lots of bubbly bubbles inside me. The bubbles make me jump. See? Hey, Scott. Oops. Sorry again, Kendra. <sighs> Scott, I think maybe you're a little bit too jumpy and excited today. I can't help it, Mr. Anthony. It feels like I have bubbles inside me that make me jump. Well, then it's time to pop the bubbles. Pop the bubbles? How? Well, it's easy. First, you stand very still. And then when the bubbles start to come out, you... some more. Pop, pop. Oh, one's getting away. I got it. Pop! Great. Now you pop your bubbles. Pop, 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 pop. Pop, pop, pop. One more. Pop! <sighs> well, the bubbles popped. Do you feel better? Not so bubbly, but... Whoa! I'm getting jumpy again! Scott, did I ever tell you about the time that Napkin Man helped his little friend Larry? Larry was a finger paint artist. I love finger painting. I know you do. But Larry had a little bit of a problem. You see, he couldn't stop jumping around. That's like me, too. Just like you. All right. Are you ready to call Napkin Man? Napkin Man! Hi, Napkin Man. Hello, Scott. Hi, Mr. Anthony. Say, I feel a draft on my head. Is anybody else chilly? Oh, Mr. Anthony, you forgot his hair. Oh, sorry, Napkin Man. No problem, Mr. Anthony. Here, you're the artist. Color it up. Oh, what a great shade of brown. Thanks, Scott. Same thing, Napkin Man. I'm Napkin Man. I'm here for you. If you're happy, sad, scared, or mad, these are all feelings I have had. I'm Napkin Man, I'll help you feel okay. Some things are kind of hard to get through, but with a little help, you can do it. Yes, you can. I'm Napkin Man. I'm Napkin Man. Swirly swirl. I think I know who made this. And this looks like a flower, sort of. And this. Ooh, what, uh, what? Wonderful, whatever it is. This just has to be painted by. Oh! <laughs> Larry! I knew it was you! I'd recognize your artwork anywhere. Hi, Napkin Man. Like it? Love it. It's so... Larry. Thanks. Want to try? Sure. Cool. My turn. Nice. Now me. <laughs> hmm. Wow. You painted a puppy. <laughs> Aw. Can I keep a napkin man? Sure, Larry. What are you going to call him? I'm going to call him 
spot. Cute. No, wait. Make that. Lots of spots. <laughs> Good one, Larry. Lots of spots. Sure has lots of spots. Hey, Napkin Man, I just had a great idea. Let's paint an awesome doghouse for lots of spots. That's a terrific plan. It's got to be really, really cool and huge. Like this. First the walls, then the roof, then the windows. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Whoops. Better try again. <laughs> Oh, I like the orange on this one. Yay! <laughs> uh, I just can't get this doghouse right. I think I know why Larry's having trouble. He's jumping around too much. He needs to concentrate to paint the doghouse straight lines. That way it won't fall down. I think you're right, Scott. Let's see what happens. Say, Larry, all that jumping around makes it hard to paint a doghouse, huh? Yeah, the walls aren't straight, and the paint is going all over the place. But I can't help it. The bubbles inside me make me jump, jump, jump. I can't stop. Oh, I know how that feels. When I get super excited and all bubbly inside and I need to calm down, it helps to pop the bubbles. Like this. Pop. 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 There's one. Pop. There's some more. Pop. 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 Two more. Pop. Pop. Ta da! You try it. Pop. 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 Gotcha. That's it. You feel a little calmer? A bit. But. Ooh, I'm still jumpy. Uh. You know what, Larry? Uh. I have a song that might help you out. There's a time and a place for jumping around, and there's nothing more fun than that. Jump, jump, jump! But there's also a time for settling down, and when it's time for that, relax. Relax? Relax. Relaxing is so great. Pop your bubbles, then just wait. And when you're nice and cool and calm, you feel like this. Ah. Huh. Then you can focus on your fun. The things that take concentration to get done. Like the painting of the doghouse for your dog. Like this! Right! There's a time to jump and a time to relax. They both are fun, but here's the facts. You'll have more fun if you jump at jumping time and relax when it's time to Napkin Man, when I'm relaxed, I'm not so jumpy, and I can paint straight lines. Yep, you got it. And to paint a really great doghouse, I need to focus and be all calm and relaxed. That's it. Okay, relax and focus. Oh, that's amazing, Larry. And it didn't fall down. Do you love it lots of spots? Do ya? Do ya? <coughs> he does love it. But he said he wants it all painted pretty. Well, we can fix that. <laughs> Home again. Right, lots of spots? Oh, you want to go inside your house? Okay, let's go. Hmm. I want to 
inside, Napkin Man. There's lots of room for all of us. So wait! Ooh, is that a trampoline? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Don't worry about the roof, Napkin Man. I'll just paint another one. And that's the story of how Napkin Man helped his friend Larry the artist paint a doghouse for his doggy. Lots of spots. Wow. Thanks, Mr. Anthony. Hey, where are you going? I'm going to go and help Kendra build the blocks that I knocked down. And I'm going to be nice and relaxed when I do it. Good idea. Hey, my little tower builders. How's the tower building going? We didn't build a tower, Miss Anthony. We built something better. A dog house! A dog house? No way! Oh, and look, it's lots of spots. Come here, boy. Oh, oh, whoa. Oh, no. Oh, no, dog pile. Ah, no, help, help. The Adventures of Napkin Man. <laughs> Pony Express. Get along, little doggies. Yeehaw! Some mighty fine lasso in there, buckaroo. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! <laughs> well, hey there, little cowgirl. This here roundup could sure use your help. I don't feel like it. If you don't mind my saying so, you seem like you're feeling kind of sad, Suki. I'm sad makes my friend Mary move away. Ooh, yes, that's a good reason to feel sad. We all miss Mary. Well, I miss her most of all because she's my best, best friend in the whole wide world. We used to play cowgirls together. She'd go, yippee ki yo and I'd go, yippee ki yay -yay. yay I remember. Oh, it's never easy when a friend moves away. Mr. Anthony, I feel achy right here. Oh, kiddo, I know you do. Well, sometimes you just have to feel sad for a little while, and that's okay. But when you're ready to get back in the saddle, you can do the achy shake. The achy shake? What's that? I'll show you. Shakey, 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 no, I don't think so. Betsy also had a very best friend named Jane. Just like Mary's my best friend in the whole world. Just like that. There. You ready to call Napkin Man? Yep. Napkin, Napkin Man. Man! Howdy, Suki. Howdy, Mr. Anthony. Yee-haw! Uh, hang on there, partner. Aren't you forgetting something? Oh, yes. One pair of cowboy boots coming <laughs> right up, buckaroo. Yee-haw! Look at me! I'm the ropingest, ridingest, napkin man cowboy around. Uh, napkin man, you're the only napkin man cowboy around. <laughs> well, by gum, you're right, cowgirl. Let's move them out! Hee-haw! I'm Napkin Man, I'm here for you. If you're happy, sad, scared, or mad, these are all feelings I have had. I'm Napkin Man, I'll help you feel okay. Some things are kind of hard to get through, but with a little help, you can do it. Yes, you can! I'm Napkin Man! Napkin Man, I'm Napkin Man. Have no fear, I'm your hero, I'm your Napkin Man. 
Why, looky here. It's Cowgirl Betsy and Cowgirl Jane. Howdy do, Cowgirls. Howdy, Lucky Man. So what are you two buckaroos up to today? Roping? Riding? We're not doing anything. Nope, we're too sad. Oh, no. Why's that? Jane's daddy got a new job. So our family's moving away today. Oh, dear, that's a mighty big change. No wonder you're sad. I have an ache right here. Oh, I know how that feels, partners. But when sadness comes a-calling and you've got an ache right here, it's time to do the achy shaky. Like this. Shaky, shaky, shaky. Shaky, shaky, shaky. Shake away that achy ache. Give it a whirl, girls. Feeling any better? A little. Thanks, Cowboy Napkin Man. My pleasure. And there's still time for one last yippee ki yay yo pony ride together before Jane rides off into the sunset, isn't there? You're right, Napkin Man. <laughs> Why, it's Daisy and Petunia. Howdy, girls. Let's go for a gallop. Want to come too, Nutki Man? Sure do. Only I don't have a pony to ride. <laughs> Nutki Man, meet Baloney the Pony. Well, howdy, Baloney. Saddle up and let's ride. <laughs> purple sagebrush, my favorite. I love purple. Yowza! Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Watch out for the tumbleweed! <laughs> I never want this day to end. I'm sure I'm gonna miss riding with you, Jane. I'm gonna miss doing everything with you, Betsy. Jane! Come on, girl, it's almost time! That's my mom. We better go. I guess this is it. Goodbye, Betsy. Goodbye, Jane. See you around, Napkin Man. So long, Jane. There goes the bestest friend a cowgirl could ever have. That's okay, Betsy. You just cry it out. <laughs> I already miss Jane. Sure you do. But even though she's moved away, you can still be friends. Just stay in touch with each other. Stay in touch? How? Even when someone is far, far away, you can still stay in touch. Any old day, just listen and I'll tell you the way. Okay. There are lots of ways to stay in touch. You can write a letter, or if that's too much, you can call them up on the telephone and then you won't feel so it really doesn't matter what you say. Just a hi, or I miss you. Or have a great day. Or if your friend is a pony, you could even say... Yay! Maybe you have a parcel to send. That's a fun way to stay in touch with a friend. You can send them a drawing or a poem or a letter. And, and that, that, my friend, will make, make you feel much better. Send Jane a parcel. Great idea, partner. It can be a friendship box full of all the things she loves. I'll send it to her by Pony Express. Come on! I dress out up all kinds of things that Jane would like. Purple sagebrush, 
She loves purple. An apple for a petunia? An apple a day makes a pony say, Yay! Now, all we need is one more thing. Perfecto. Thank you, Tumbleweed. Can you send this to my friend Jane by Pony Express, please? Sure thing, Betsy. Whoa, wait a minute. Wouldn't it be awesome if Betsy got a friendship box from Jane, too? You know what, Cowgirl Suki? That would be downright awesome. Oh, hang on a second, Betsy. This just came for you. It's from Jane! Look, purple sagebrush. Just like you sent her. And an apple for Daisy. And one for Baloney, too. Just like they like. And a tumbleweed. Now that's a great cowgirl roping, riding friendship box. Yep, yeah, because Jane is the bestest friend ever. Yee -haw! Yee -haw! That's the story of how Napkin Man helped cowgirl Betsy and her best friend Jane to stay in touch. There you go. Thanks, Mr. Anthony. I'm going to make a friendship box for Mary, and I'm going to put this drawing in it. Why, that's the bestest idea I've heard, cowgirl Suki. You know what else? Hey, cowboys and cowgirls, let's round up some drawings to send to our friend Mary. And you know what else? We don't have to wait for the Pony Express. I can scan them into my computer and email them to her mom. Hey, how, Mr. Anthony? That way she can get them right away. That's right. Mary! Daddy, it's Suki. Gallop on over here and have a gander at who it is. Mary, I was just missing you. I miss you too, Suki. In fact, there is something I've been wanting to tell you all day. Yippee ki yay yo, cowgirl Suki. Yippee ki yay yay, cowgirl Mary.